All right, let's do final trades. You guys have a little bit extra extra time. Not not that you know this talkative group needs that. I don't need to tell you that. I shouldn't have told you that. <laughs> Rob Seachin, go first. So IWR, the iShares, uh, Russell Midcap. I think you have to keep some of the cyclical exposure in the mix. I think we've all talked about being slightly overbought, but if you want to play catch up, what we've seen this week is a lot of performance on that side of the equation, and I think this is one of the best ways to play that. All right, good stuff. You have a uh, enjoyable long weekend, uh, Megan. You too. Um, emerging market equities. We are actually underweight, so this isn't necessarily a buy. Uh, we're underweight to emerging market equities. We do think there's more volatility ahead of us. The market's not going to climb straight up. If we do have higher volatility, it's probably going to be a stronger dollar environment. You also have China trade tensions and some potential oil weakness. So we're cautious on emerging market equities right now. All right. Quickly, Shannon. CME Group, like the exchanges here, are a great way to wade into financials if you don't want to buy the banks. Weiss, give me a quick name. XBI, I think, goes higher, of course. Jim Lamenthal. Pfizer, uh, one of Dr. Fauci's shots on goals. They're in the vaccine race. Yep, uh, there's our group there.